Hello and welcome to this tutorial on optimizing your PC to run the VCI or the Bosch Master Tech Vehicle Communication Interface. I'm going to show you some recommended settings to get the best performance from your new diagnostic system. We're going to start by getting on the screen and just right clicking anywhere so we get this pop-up menu and select personalize. Make sure your screensaver setting is set to none. Select screensaver if it's not set to none. Then in the drop down menu, select the none option, click apply, and then OK. You can now close this window. Next, we're going to open the control panel by clicking on start. Select control panel. We're going to select system and security. We're going to select Windows Firewall and we're going to turn it off. Make sure that both your home and public networks are turned off. Next you're going to hit the back button. We're going to select Windows Update. You can check for updates and install any updates that need to be installed. After you've performed this task, I want you to go to Change Settings and select the option to never check for updates so you will start checking for updates manually click OK click back next we're going to go to power options select power options make sure high performance is selected then we're going to change plan settings make sure all of these options are set to never Adjust the plan brightness to your preferred setting. Select Save Changes. Next, we will select Change Advanced Power Settings. Under Advanced Power Settings, expand Wireless Adapter Settings. Expand Power Saving Mode. Make sure both options are set to maximum performance. If it's not, click on the hyperlink and you will get a drop down menu so that you can change it. Next we want to scroll down to USB settings, expand our USB settings, expand our USB selective suspend. Make sure both of these options are set to disabled. Next we're going to scroll down and expand power buttons and lid, expand lid closing action and again make sure this is on do nothing. Go to power button action and change it to shut down. That's the final setting that we need to make under advanced settings. So you will click apply and then select OK. You can close all of your windows now. Turn off any antivirus program that you have. If you have a third party antivirus program, it is recommended to uninstall those. If you need to uninstall an antivirus program, select start control panel go down here to where it says programs and below that you'll see uninstall a program select uninstall programs scroll down until you see the antivirus program that you want to remove also it's a good idea if you've got any trial versions of software that you don't plan on using to remove those as well so select your antivirus program that you want to uninstall and uninstall it and follow the prompts Make sure you select please remove all user data. And that's it. Uh, restart your system. Please note that your battery life will be reduced due to the new settings, but your computer will be optimized for using it as a scan tool, which is what we're setting this up to do. So it is recommended that whenever possible, use your power supply. Thank you for taking the time to watch this tutorial and be sure to look for more tutorials to come in this series.